The distribution of fresh water across the countries and continents is unfair. Every day, 1 in 10 people on the planet doesn't have access to fresh water. And many who have, have to walk many miles in order to get it. In the western world, you just have to open the tap. 6% of all deaths in low income countries are the result of unsafe water sources like dirty rivers. It doesn't have to be this way. There are many smart technologies that can make the distribution of fresh water around the world more fair and make sure that as many people as possible have access to fresh water. In this video of Keys to the Future, we discuss the top 3 inventions to solve the global water crisis. There is 6 times more water in the form of water vapor in the atmosphere than there is in all the wells around the world. There are several techniques that are used on a small scale in Africa and the Middle East which can take this water out of the atmosphere and convert it to liquid water. One of these techniques is the special solar panel source from the startup Zero Mass Water. A source panel generates an average of 2 to 5 liters of water per day. They can be used anywhere, even in the middle of the desert. So, you can understand why this invention has enormous potential and can make a big impact worldwide. The panel uses sunlight to produce heat, allowing it to capture water vapor from the air. This is sterilized and converted into liquid water. The device adds minerals to increase the pH value of the water. Next to access, another equally big issue of the water crisis is the lack of sanitation. Poor sanitation causes more than 1200 deaths of children under 5 years old every single day. This number is bigger than the deaths from AIDS, for example. The organization Sanivation has found a solution for this and now operates on a small scale in Kenya. They provide home toilets and waste treatment in Kenyan neighborhoods in an economically sustainable way. The feces are collected weekly and instead of viewing it as trash and throwing it away, they use it to make a product out of it. The feces are treated by technologies that run on solar energy which kill all the pathogens, after which it is mixed with agricultural residue. The result is a product that can be used as a replacement for the traditional car coal. There are no carbon emissions and it burns three times longer than traditional car coal. On top of that, for every ton of feces car coal sold, 88 trees are saved. If the government would implement this solution to the sanitation problem on a bigger scale, this problem would be solved for most part. Did you know that there is two times as much energy in wastewater as the energy that is needed to reuse it? Instead of reusing the wastewater, the government spends a lot of money in order to get rid of the water. By not reusing this water, not only do you in fact throw away free energy, but in dry areas the water scarcities get worse. So, in South Carolina, the government thought of a way to reuse wastewater. It gets collected in a natural underground aquifer, where it gets filtered by membranes that remove contaminants from the water after which the water streams to the city again. This was the climate top 3 on the topic of solving the global water crisis. If you would like to see more educational and inspirational videos, please subscribe to Keys to the Future and turn on the notification bell. See you next video!